So what's up, y'all? Right here, I got the Elden Ring mod pack. Well, Elden Ring or Shattered Ring, whichever one you want to call it. This does have custom music on it, but the music isn't playing right now. But we're going to go into the mod pack. Hold on, let me show you which mods I got on here. All right, so we got the real source texture pack. We got... The Edge PvP, we got Ancient Weaponry. The Edge PvP adds the music. The Elden Ring music. We got Medieval Gear, New Bows, Backpacks, Mantles, which is Armor, Mousy Mobs, which has bosses, New new Mutant Creatures, which is like, which is like bosses. We got Vanilla's Fantasy, which will be updated in the next download. We got Pocket Mythology, we got Dark Age, we got At uh, Alice's Mobs, Aeon Fantasy, and Fight for Villagers. And right here, we also got Structures and Healing Campfires. Because in Elden Ring, you got fires that heal you, or areas that heal. This, you can add it if you want. I mean, it's really just, it's mainly loading screens, Elden Ring loading screens, pretty much. All right, let's load into the world. I'm a, little, I'm a little sick. I just had something. I ain't sick, but I had something in my eyeball. And then um, I got to scratch it out. But yeah, this is this is pretty much starting, starting to become just like Jabba's Shattered Ring or Elden Ring. Which, you know... Bedrock Edition is way different than Java Edition, so you gotta do everything a certain way. You gotta use certain mods you can use and certain add-ons, certain textures. This is still in beta, so half the stuff in it might not work and half the stuff will work. And you, I don't know about multiplayer yet. Multiplayer is like, I don't know, I haven't tried it. But I know if you're on a PC or you're on Xbox, then it should run fast. But if you're on an Android, it should run real slow, depending on which type of Android you got. An iPhone, I got an iPhone and it runs well, but certain times I, I can crash. All right, so I've already showed y'all most of it, but all right, so I'm gonna show y'all a little more this is where I was playing yesterday, but I had to. I was also checking stuff out because I played this myself. All right, so I'm not gonna show you all the mobs, but we got some new crafting tables and things y'all can use once I find them. Um, also, if you want the combat from the first preview, you gotta download 3D Combat, which. I don't have on here because I took it off. So you got that table of mages so you can be a wizard or something. Uh, this is supposed to be a weapons crafting table, but it's missing this texture. So I'm saying there's certain bugs on here. Um, I thought there was more, but there's not. Here goes the healing campfire. You got two of them. Um... The way you use the backpack, by the way, once you craft the backpack or whatever, you have to, I'm not sure if it works or not, but yeah, this heals you. Um, these unlock certain things that you can craft. Like if you go on a normal crafting table, you wouldn't be able to find those things. So, but yeah, the way this works, you would basically have to get a sleeping bed first. I'm not sure how you do it, honestly. I'm gonna be real. Um, but I'm pretty sure. Let's see, that's what I'm saying. I'm not. I'm not sure. I know you can open the backpack and stuff though. I'm just not sure how it really works. But yeah. Um let's see. We got new ores on here as well. 
and I'll leave a zip file. Like I'm gonna leave a a folder, a folder download. Basically, you can download all the mods in there. Like and then I'm gonna have the world download where you can download the world and stuff. So then you can just download the map and then go straight to playing. And then what you call it? Um, the zip file also has some mods in there that you can add if you want to add it. Like it's not added to the game yet. You gotta add it yourself. So yeah. Um, some of the loading screens, by the way. You have to go in like the end and stuff like that, this and that, to see those loading screens. Right here, um, oh, it's supposed to be right there. That's probably another bug. It's supposed to be the Mousies mobs thing, so you can see like what they do and what's their weaknesses and stuff like that. But yeah, um, I'm still updating this, so just so y'all know if you do play it if you download the world and play on the world you'll have to wait until i update the game again to keep all your stuff so best way to do it would be to download the zip files and just add all the mods yourself but the only reason i do the world files is because if you download the if you download the world file you can just go straight to play you don't have to worry about sitting there and sorting out the mods and putting them in the right places that they gotta be in you can just go straight to playing so with that being said i guess okay hold on leave leave a uh, keep inventory on if you play because in Elden ring you don't lose your inventory so it would make sense for you to keep your inventory and also make sure make sure that um, it's really not, um, like, mandatory to do it. You can just play in third person or not. I mean, if you download the 3D combat, I would play in third person most diff because it looks, it looks nice. But other than that, yeah. I'm gonna leave the download link in the description. Y'all leave a like, subscribe, and stay frosty.